more breaking news. A tragic shooting this morning, this time in Stanley County. Now this is all happening along Canton Road in Albemarle. You can see deputies are combing the scene outside this house where a family of four members lived. Three of them are now dead and our Gina Esposito has been there for hours talking to investigators. Gina, the details of this are just devastating. You know, the sheriff says they've been speaking with family members who just can't believe this. Uh, we aren't releasing the names of the people who died just yet. We don't have that information because some family members are still being notified. I can tell you that the sheriff said this all happened here at this home on Canton Road. Three people were found dead inside. Investigators have been here for six hours. Uh, we know that they're going to start removing the bodies in just a couple of minutes. There was a fourth victim who climbed out the back window of this home. He ran to this home and tried to get help. This is some video we shot of investigators going into the home. They're hoping an evidence inside the house can lead to more clues. The sheriff says a neighbor called them around 6 o'clock this morning. The man who was shot was banging on her door for help. We're told that neighbor wasn't sure what was happening, so she called 911. When deputies arrived, they found him on the street. Right now, the sheriff's office is calling this a death investigation. They aren't looking for any suspects, but this is a tragic case. All four victims lived at this house. The sheriff hopes to bring closure to the family. Oh, we are definitely going to be speaking with the families um, in hopes that they can shed some light on this because this is not a common occurrence in, in our county, much less this community. I just checked in the 24 year old man who was shot and survived. He's in stable condition at a hospital in Concord. He is awaiting surgery. Here live in Stanley County, I'm Gina Esposito, Channel 9 Eyewitness News.